So, Pastor, how's things going at the church? Please, call me Jeff. <laughs> and everything's going great, because I have the coolest boss. I'm sorry, but I'm kind of having a hard time feeling the Holy Spirit calling you Jeff. I'm going to stick with Pastor. Sure. Thank you, Pastor. Mm. Yeah, that feels better. So nice of you to come over, Pastor Jeff. He prefers Jeff. I'm staying with Pastor. Wait, I changed my mind. I'm going with PJ. Brings to mind pajamas, but that's fine, too. Anyway, I'm sorry to drag you into this, but it is demon, so it's in your purview. It is indeed. In fact, at a recent Young Baptist Leaders Conference, I attended a seminar on satanic leisure activities. And? And the important lesson is rather than have a parent or authority figure take the offending game away, let God remove it, root and stem. Question, PJ. Uh, how's the big guy do that? Simple. Sheldon needs to start attending Sunday school. If he likes books with demons and devils, I've got one that will blow his mind. <laughs> what book is that? The Bible, George. Sure, yeah. yeah. I think that's a wonderful idea, although I am concerned that we may get a little pushback from Sheldon. A little? No, I won't go. I don't believe in God. Well, now, what you believe in is not the point. Mary. If I may, Sheldon, I understand you hope to be a scientist someday. Yes, sir. Well, let me ask you a question. You say you don't believe in God, but what kind of scientist comes to a conclusion without first doing the research? A bad scientist. That's right. So I'll see you Sunday morning at 8 o'clock. No, you won't. I cast a second level spell of invisibility on myself. Well, that game isn't making him any smarter. Why aren't you asleep? I'm studying for Sunday school. You're reading the Bible? That's wonderful. I do have a question. Sure, what? Is there anyone in our town from the Amalek tribe? I don't know, why? If there is, we're supposed to kill them. And their cows. Well, no. There's no Amaleks. Told ya.